So Juan likes rice and chicken is our doc now inspired by Hero Dreams of Sushi. And in general, we just wanted to do a food documentary in season two. And I think Hero is one we all loved. And you wrote this one. I yeah. did, yeah. yeah. And you, but you three went to Columbia, so you're really the heroes. <laughs> yes. Yeah, we did. It, we were <coughs> out in nature, and I'm not great with nature. You're not? Not, a, yeah. Didn't you just take a canoe trip? I did, but <laughs> in a city. Okay. <laughs> uh, I had people lift up the canoe. <laughs> because you love to travel. I actually do love to travel. You love to travel. You went to Iceland last yes. year. Yes. You went to Columbia this year. Yeah. And this is not a complaint. I'm just saying yeah. that it really was out there. And there was no joke, a tarantula on the set. Working. That, well, working. <laughs> <laughs> the way that the Colombians were about the tarantula was very calm, which made everyone else calm. They were yeah. just sort of giggled about it. You also described the tarantula to me as like, it looked like a fake. Yes. <laughs> it looked, I think people took pictures of it too. It looked fake. Yeah, looked like a like, puppet tarantula. Yeah. Yeah. And the Colombians, <laughs> they were like, they just came and walked up. Yeah, they, had, they like, were a not piece scared. of paper and they're just like, oh, okay. yeah. Yeah. And I explained to them that they should be scared. <laughs> I was like, no, you're supposed to be scared. <laughs> yeah. Scared? <laughs> and there was a bee, we had a bee attack. Oh, yeah, as the well. bee attack, that's right. On the last day, um, I wanted to do a shot from a hill looking down, seeing Juan's truck drive through, but there was a hedge in the way. And so we asked if there was a way of cutting just the top of the hedge down a little bit. And so the producers, the Colombian producer, um, Pamela, said, she, she go do it. And uh, about 20 minutes later, I walk out of the set and she's bawling her eyes out. And there's a medic with like a syringe and tra And she'd been basically, she'd like taken a machete herself um, and cut right into a bee's nest. And, uh, and, and these were like, they were like angry. jungle bees. Jungle bees, they yeah. Were, so they were really vicious, like crazy welts. And um, yeah, she had one on her chin, and her chin was just like a baseball. <laughs> but one of the of the hotels, uh, someone from our art department, yeah, our production designer, yeah, Katie Byron, got stung by a scorpion. Yeah, I mm -hmm. changed hotels in fear because uh -huh. we were all at the same hotel, and she did not. She was yeah. more brave than I was. Yeah. I was just like... <laughs> and then you slept in a bed with a flashlight and a handgun. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Was, you, and you had a practical yeah. chicken in your lap. Yes. Did it's an actual yeah. chicken. And you dri while driving stick. That's right. right. You learned how to drive a stick. Yeah. Just for that one road, though. <laughs> you know, so I, I knew how to a go... A lot of people, when they learn stick, one of the first things they say is, don't do it with a chicken in your lap. <laughs> right. Oh, that was yeah. the stick. I used the chicken as the stick. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> just kind of... Yeah.